blessings upon blessings upon blessings to everybody out there in the fantasy football YouTube world. It's your girl, Shell. We are relaxing outside. <clears throat> I'm going to do two parts. I might go live for my start set. But we're doing entries now. A little bit of news. Phillies advanced to the next stage of the World Series. They beat they beat the Braves like eight to three or something like that. I don't I'm not really into baseball, but my baseball team is the Cubs, but I'm not really into baseball. And we got uh, NCAA men's basketball coming up in I think it's less than a week. No, less than a month. It's like three three weeks from now. So y'all get ready for that. TCU beat Oklahoma State. I called that. Baylor, they're going up in the rankings too. And I think TCU takes the uh, Big 12. Count it. Uh, Baylor, definitely out of the top 25. Bama, all I want to do is laugh. Because we got these folks. It was a great game. Stop taking away what you think Bama got screwed over a penalty. Because Bama's been doing that for decades. So Philly advanced on into the World Series. Or not the World Series, but the playoffs. Wentz fractured finger out week six. Jonathan Taylor's out. Two will return next week. I think I put on a short that he was uh, ready to play this week, but he's not. Russell Wilson's in, Teddy uh, Bridgewater in, but back up. Uh, Damian Harris, Hammy, he's a game-time decision. Uh, Chris Olave's a game-time decision, and so is Mac Jones. Najee Harris had a plate in his foot. I didn't know that. Did y'all know that? Maybe that was the reason why he wasn't really running so good. Uh, he had that removed, so I'm going to be watching him. And then T. Higgins. I had T. Higgins as a sleeper, a breakout, and everything else. But, yeah, these uh, injuries are kicking my behind. Hold on, that's my best friend. These uh, injuries are kicking my behind. Also, I want to put on, since we're only at two minutes, I want to put on everybody's radar trades. Trades or just get rid of players. Okay, I'm gonna do this before week seven. You can either uh, bust, call it what you want. Allen Robinson, uh, DJ Shark, since Jonathan Josh Reynolds has a a lot more targets, so you can either drop these players or try to trade them. I wouldn't trade them. I mean, I, if I was looking at somebody you were uh, trading to and these were the players you were giving me, yeah, no. I'd laugh at you. Uh, Julio Jones, torn PCL. Come on now. Juju, not looking, uh, not lacking in targets. He's just lacking in efficiency. Ooh. Oh, no, that's my stuff. He's lacking in efficiency. Like, he has the targets, but he doesn't go nowhere. Or does he have any touchdowns? Uh, and T. Higgins, man. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. I'm sorry. Uh, Chase Edmonds. I was looking at the wrong list. Chase freaking Edmonds. I got Juju, and I got Chase Edmonds. So I'm feeling you guys, okay? Um, that's about it. I will do a start sip video in about 30 minutes. Please like, share, and subscribe. And add my Twitter, which is Girls Advice and Views of Fantasy Football. Peace. Stay blessed. And above all, stay high, my friends.